Welcome to the recap of the Land Super 2023 Fall Launch, where I'm going to quickly show you the highlights of the new things that we've introduced in the most recent launch of Land Super. Starting with the IT Agent. Now, the IT Agent is now in preview, meaning that you are able to go ahead and try it out. Our IT Agent is basically the successor of LS Agent, combining both the strength of LS Agent with the older LS Push agent that we have to give you all sorts of new functionality, meaning that you can trigger scans on demand, you have maintenance windows that you can configure, and most importantly, the data does no longer have to go through relays and other things. It can go straight from your asset to the cloud site that you have. Next up is Risk Insights, where we added multiple improvements starting with that we added additional information to the Risk Insights area, including the patch information. We also gave you additional options to sort, so now you can have multiple sorting, so you can prioritize your vulnerabilities better. And we're also allowing or added a extra dashboard for vulnerabilities, a specific vulnerability dashboard in your site is now also available. And last but not least, we have also added a preview in the on-premise so you can view some of your uh, aggregated vulnerability information on your local on-premise web console. And if you want to use your data or the data that Landsuper has about vulnerabilities in integrations, we now also allow you to use the vulnerability data in the API, so it is fully available for any integration that you have set up. Next up, OT Inventory, where if you remember in our last launch, we started working towards allowing you to manage your OT assets more offline, as most, most of the times these networks are separated from your regular IT networks. Today, we're taking the next step. We're allowing you to also add your OT devices to your local on-premises Landsweeper installation. So we can view all of your OT assets in a closed off on-premise environment. Also new is we added a couple of more integrations. So if you are waiting for a few integrations, we added a or multiple new integrations that you can try out if you have your Landsweeper site ready. And we have added a few more on-premise improvements as well, starting with that we upgraded the backend of the on-premise to .NET 6.0, which brings with it aside from some increased security, also some increased functionality, meaning that now there is proxy support for syncing your local Landsweeper on-premises with your Landsweeper site. On top of that, as I mentioned, we have the Risk Insights preview, where you can preview the data from your Risk Insights module if you have a link to the cloud. And also we have additional uh, an additional view in the on-premise now where you can also view the integrations. So if you want to see which integrations are available and you are or you do not have access to a Landsweeper site, you can now also view it on-premise. And one of the major additions to the on-premise is that we added scan times for all different asset types. Previously, that was only available for Windows, but now you can view which scanning targets were used when it was last scanned, all of that. You can see it for any uh, asset type available. Next up, public cloud inventory. One of the big new features that are upcoming is now in beta, so you can sign up to try it out. This means that we'll be able to allow you to scan Azure, AWS, and Google Cloud, and doing it much more advanced than what we were previously able to do, giving you access or data to all different kinds of resources and metrics and data points that those platforms have. Uh, you can see some of them on the big list here. But obviously, if you want to try this out, I encourage you to sign up for the Public Cloud Inventory beta so you can try it out. And we'll need feedback on how we prevent, present to you all of that data in the best way possible. So with that, that's most of the highlights of the Land Super 2023 fall launch. You can check out our website for more information on all the features that I mentioned.